North Carolina teacher resigns after taping 11-year-old's mouth shut, he was humiliated. The North Carolina teacher resigned days after the incident. A North Carolina mother is speaking out after her son sent her a photo from his classroom showing his mouth taped shut in a disciplinary measure taken by his teacher. Catherine Webster told WRAL-TV that her 11-year-old son Brady had sent her a photo last month from his Smithfield Middle School 6th grade classroom, showing his mouth covered with several strips of blue painter's tape over his mouth after he allegedly had been too talkative in class. I don't know what to do, Brady's text message to his mother said. He was humiliated, Webster told the outlet. Webster told that her son had been taped at the beginning of class and forced to sit through the entire period like that and that two of his classmates also had been taped that same day. It had been going on for a while before this day, Webster said of the alleged disciplinary measure. His teacher never once called me to discuss his behavior, so I wasn't aware he was a problem for her. Catherine Webster immediately took the issue to the principal's office, and an investigation was launched. WRAL-TV reported that the teacher, who had just been hired in August 2022, had resigned on February 17, just days after the photo was taken. We can confirm that whenever such allegations arise, our administration responds swiftly by investigating the allegations and, sometimes, by removing staff from classrooms pending completion of a thorough review, the school system said in a statement to the outlet. An investigation by the Johnson County Sheriff's Office found that several other allegations against the teacher had been made, but determined after consulting with the district attorney that an assault charge was not warranted, according to WRAL-TV. Webster told that she is satisfied with the way the principal acted immediately to ensure that the teacher was not in class the next day but is speaking out now to call for accountability so that this situation can't happen again in the future and the teacher is not allowed to simply move to another jurisdiction. Just because Brady didn't get hurt doesn't make this any less serious, Webster said. Reached out to the Johnson County Sheriff's Office for comment but did not immediately receive a response. 